Now, let's cover the importance to maintain your old Volvo in working condition every day. Patrick's Garage. Grab your snack, welcome back. And first, yes, you agree with me that car for driving. So a car should be in good working condition, especially if you have two cars. One of them always should be in good working condition, because you want to go anywhere, you want to go to grocery, you want to go to swimming pool, you want just to riding around to your neighborhood, probably your car should be in good working condition all the time. And this is the most reason to maintain your old Volvo in good working condition in 2024 even today because you want riding around your car and more than this you want to repair your second car probably you have two cars you know i have two cars and i want to riding around on one of them so one of them should be always in good working condition i decided this for me a long time ago and you know now i'm trying to not disassembling my car uh, and not taking apart these engines. One engine should be in good working condition. You know, my two cars with two engines and one engine take apart. So I'm planning to rebuild this engine and I'm not going to hurry, not going to rush with this maintaining process rebuilding. And one car always should be in good working condition for that you want to go to grocery you want to go to church you want maintain your car in good working condition now if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet please do click the subscribe button and notifications bell so that way you can be notified as soon as i upload new videos about car repairing and this is the real reason to maintain your car in good working condition because you want to tinkering with another car which in a garage and waiting when you go and continue messing around with engine so this is a really good reason to have two car one car you repair and one car you have for driving now, if you really like my videos, please share it with your friend. The thing is, when you start rebuilding the engine, you always have no any ballpark idea what, what, how many hours you want to spend the engine rebuilding. So one car always should be in working condition. So you want to relaxing and go to the garage and rebuilding the car which intended for rebuilding right now. Probably later you change these cars and you want to repair this car and you want to driving around on the car which now in a garage. And you don't want to have a limited period of time for rebuilding the engine, for repairing the car. You don't want to bust in your ass. At this short period of time, you don't want to pushing yourself to do this work. So this can be turns out that you will hate your work. Your passion can be turns out for these things which you don't want to do if you have a limited period of time to do to accomplish these things. So it will be better to have unlimited time to rebuild the engine. Probably you never finish this process, but <laughs> let's hope that it will be done. Because if this is will be enjoyable, you can do these things more faster. So this enjoyable process lead you to the good results i think you don't want to be squashed in this uh, time limit so this is the real reason why you don't want to maintain your 
old Volvo, Volvo Amazon, Volvo 140 series, 240 series, even 940 series in good working condition. You know, start time uh, want to restore my car. I have another car, second car, which I'm using uh, for driving around to go to buy spare parts, maybe in a long distance from me so far, I want to use next uh, car, which I get later, my first car, you know, one forty series. And uh, this real reason to have car and maintain car in good working condition so you can use this car, even this car in a garage. When I'm uh, working welding, you know, there is, the, this is very long period of time can be process extended. So I know I don't want to do any things which will stop my car so it stops in a garage with disassembled things, electric things, even battery I don't want to pull out. Yes, I want to charge from time to time. And thing is, I remember to say you that you always want to disconnect alternator during this long period welding process because you can hurt the engine you uh, heart the alternator, you know, this is diodes inside, very sensitive to welding machine, a lot of electricity, you know. You can just burn the diodes inside the alternator if you want to enjoy with welding a lot of time, yes. A really fascinating process, this welding. So I don't want to disassembling engine during the welding process because I don't uh, I don't know when I'm going to stop this process with welding. So you don't want to do all this work with restoration at one time. You want to extend this process day to day. You doing a little, a little. Uh, in each time you can do small things and you split all these big job to a small period and you day to day doing all these things which you planned before this all big goal to rebuild the car completely but in small chunks you doing this and this will be more enjoyable so this is being a reason that another car should be in good working condition your old volvo volvo amazon volvo 140 series this is similar engines they should be in and uh, parts a lot of parts interchangeable so these cars should be always in good working condition so you want to maintain them in good working condition your old volvos from series. and probably this is the main thing why i don't want to turn my passion into them a uh, professional mechanic war so i don't want to turn this to war my passion and i want to repairing my car just for my own enjoy i don't want to working every day with cars this is very harmful for breath you know for health you don't want to breath all the time this chemicals this break parts dust and uh, all these horrible smells because you know when they start to go working as mechanics they doing this filthy job i mean dirty job they are replacing brake pads you know they working with these uh, dusty things like brakes under the car they changing the oil young mechanics i mean so when you go to a car center car care center they want to give you for this simple work as a as they think the young people young people working and uh, you know this uh, young guy can uh, forget 
these bolts, nuts, uh, now to protect protective power to the lower part of engine. And a lot of time I just tracing on them and see what they doing. As in a lot of times they forget about nuts of this uh, protection cover this plate which on the bottom under the engine to protect the engine. But this not protect from <laughs> young mechanics who don't know what they doing. So I don't want to transform my passion to professional mechanic work because this professional work will killing the passion slowly in a lot of case yes when i before when i not worked as a driver i like to my own enjoyable process driving my car but now i don't want uh, driving car <laughs> yes i can driving in my own pleasure yes if i really need to go anywhere 